What is going on? Darth Sticks here, and today we are going to do the week 109 update of our account. Uh, this account has been around for 109 weeks now. We are going to take Mon Mothma to Relics here. Uh, I'm hoping to get her... Um, it'd be nice to get her to Relic 3, honestly, so we could use that in uh, GAC. Um, we are going to have to get her to Relic 5 eventually, uh, but this week I'm not sure what we're going to be able to do. Um, do want to... She's got to go to Relic 5, but we could take some other characters up as well. And we'll kind of take a look and see uh, what we can do, what's available. And yeah, let's take a look at our Rebels. Uh, we took Old Ben up last week, and that has uh, paid off fairly well. And we look at the Datacrons, and we do have that Datacron that we could still use. Uh, it did not go away for the Rebel Fighters. All of our Scoundrel ones did go away, unfortunately. Uh, but we will uh, go in here, and I think C-3PO... And we can get him to Relic 5. That would be awesome. Uh, that would finish him off for the Jedi Master Luke uh, journey. And eventually he'll have to go to 7 for Jabba anyways. Uh, but we will go ahead and not worry about that right now. So Relic 5 there. We are out of Bronzium uh, as always. Uh, always running out of Bronzium it seems like. Uh, we'll go in here and see what we can salvage. Uh, real quick. Uh, so, and we may check and see if any of those uh, lovely Carbonite circuit boards are in the shops right now. Uh, so we could add some of those to our collection. That's going to be an easy way to get them. Uh, we did not do any of the side farms. Uh, this week we were focusing on Chirotex to get uh, Mon Mothma up and going. Uh, but we're actually making pretty good progress on the Bronzium. So we might be in a pretty good spot. Uh, we'll leave some of those and we can come in here and do a couple of these here and there, everywhere, get some bronzium. Um, we'll leave it there for now. We can come back if we need some more, kind of see where we want to be uh, right now. Um, so yeah, Mon Mothma or C-3PO finished off for now for that Jedi Master Luke uh, journey. We've got to get C-3PO to Relic 7, Mon Mothma to 5, uh, and then we've got a couple other characters we need to bring up from 3 to 5, and then we should be pretty good. Uh, let's go in here and see what we can salvage real fast, or scrap, scavenger, whatever you want to say. Um, and yeah, we can do a few of these. Uh, we don't have a whole lot here. Um, well, we can do a little bit, try at least keep 20 or so in there of all these parts. Um, and we are going to drag the bottom of the barrel here this week. It looks like, uh, we can do a few of these and yeah, so 23, we are able to scrap. That's not too bad. So we got up to 36. Uh, I think we need, yeah, we need 30 for the first level or for relic. Um, or for Relic 2, actually, is what we needed. Um, so, um, you know, I'd like to get her to Relic 3. Honestly, would. Um, but Relic 2 might be where she ends at for this week, which is going to be kind of weird. We could use our Cron if we have it available. Uh, Darth Bane, we're making pretty good progress. We're at 203. We did buy the Conquest Pass again. Uh, since we were getting, I felt like this time it was a much better deal since you are getting the Ben Solo uh, shards as well. So we'll get 30 of those plus the extra for Darth Bane plus the ones for Queen Amidala. Uh, we'll see if we continue to buy it or not. $10 a month is a little steep for really what we're getting. I still feel like it's a good deal, but honestly, I am uh, feeling worn out already on this conquest. Uh, it is pretty easy. Uh, we've got quite a few feats done, um, but we've got a long ways to go still. And let's see what we get from this drop. 500 of these, uh, 500. And we got 150, so that is a, a little bit higher than what we got the last time. Last time, I think we, both of them dropped uh, 100. So we are, oh, we got 150 this time, so that's actually pretty good. Uh, we could buy some more of those, but for right now, I think I'm going to leave it there. Uh, I'm happy with those drops. 
Um, and we can go back in and check Mon Mothma. And I think we're going to need some more bronzium wiring, it looks like. Uh, so we need like 13 more of those, it looks like. Uh, getting those shipments, though, does help quite a bit. Uh, we could buy some from the Conquest store if we wanted to. But I think we will... Um, hmm, I think we can go... There's not a whole lot there that we could do. We do a one there, and then we need, what, 11 more? Uh, and we could do, like, these we're not really using. Mark V I don't want to do. Uh, computers would be fine. Yeah, some of those. Okay, I think that's, we got 26 there. That's pretty good. Uh, so that gives us 53, so that'll be enough to get her to Relic 3. I'm pretty happy with that. Uh, so next week... If we plan on taking her 3 to 5, and then if we take R2 to R7, uh, I think that will be a pretty solid plan. Uh, we'll work on getting our materials and everything built back up. Uh, so we are going to be Cantina pretty hard uh, to get those uh, am uh, relic amplifiers and everything that we need from there. So yeah, I think R2 next week. And yeah, unfortunately, we're just a little short of what we need for that. Should have plenty of... Uh, carbonite circuit boards and we can keep continue farming where we're farming i think we'll get be in a good pretty good spot um we are looking at galactic republic i just want to see what we can bring up we are at plo Koon. i'd like to work on mace uh qui-gon's already at relic or i mean at gear 12 um so that's pretty good and here's our farms we are working on we did finish off captain rex uh so another non-accelerated character that we have finished and he can we can start working on that at some point. Uh, goes on our Phoenix Squad, pretty nice there. Uh, we did get uh, Trip Zero there to five already, and I think we'll probably add in um, our little R two unit that we've got to add. Whatever B, whatever I can't even think of his name right now. That goes with the Afra Squad, and a couple of ca farms, Cantina farms there, and we should be able to go for Afra. Um, we can do Droidica, it looks like, so we'll go ahead and give Droidica another level. Um, we may look at um, giving Droidica the Omicron pretty close to where I think we have a viable squad. Uh, I'd like to give a few more of those up. We do need to apply Zeta to B1, um, so I think that'll be pretty good investment there. Uh, we can look at Separatist... Or look at another faction here, Jedi. Uh, just kind of see where we're at. I think Mace is probably safe uh, for the new raid. Qui-Gon. Uh, I'm not sure if Qui-Gon is now that they're going to release another uh, Master Qui-Gon. Uh, I'm not sure if that is the right move to invest in the current Qui-Gon. Nuke Gunray, I feel like, is going to be a solid choice. Uh, he definitely appears in that movie, and I think he's pretty iconic. And I think uh, just getting him to gear 12, I don't have any reservations with getting him at least to gear 12 uh, so that we could take him. Once they announce kind of a list, we can take a few of them up to relics. He is needed, uh, I believe, for Lord Vader anyways. Uh, and I think he has to be at relic 7 for that. So I think that's a possibility. Um, I'm not going to invest in any clones right now. And we are working on the Gungans as they come out. Uh, I think I will probably for the next one that will probably be uh, might already be out by the time this video uh, drops if they keep the same cadence that they have been. Uh, I think we will uh, go ahead and buy the two uh, packs that we need um, to go ahead, gamble packs, to go ahead and get that one up and uh, get some extra shards of it uh, a little bit there. So Raven's Claw does get a six star, and we'll continue working on that. We're getting pretty close. Uh, happy with where we're at in fleets. Uh, comeuppance, uh, we can probably start working on that. It's going to be a cantina farm, so that should be pretty quick. Uh, but right now we are working on uh, a couple other things. We, of course, need our relic materials out of there. Then we have a Sith Empire Trooper uh, that we need to finish off first, and then we'll come back and get the comeuppance. But we don't need that many more shards for uh, Sith Empire. So we'll work on that, though. Uh, TIE Interceptor, I don't think I want to invest any more in this one right now. Uh, I'm happy to invest right now in the cup opens. If we get a couple other of these um, up and running. And uh, I'm like, 
I think I'm going to save off on that one. Maybe we'll do it next week uh, to kind of finish off that fleet. Uh, we are using Radis right now on defense uh, for the most part in GAC. We're also throwing at our Territory Wars. Uh, we are using it as one of our back fleets as an option. So I'm using it. Uh, so I don't feel like it's wasted um, there. Uh, actually, I don't know if most people have got to our back fleet. So I don't know if I have any hold data for it from our stuff. But uh, I do uh, enjoy uh, putting it on defense. It's something there. As you can see, we're working on Bane still. Hoping to have him pretty far along. And uh, we'll see if we have to do a proving grounds or something for him. Uh, we may have to, unfortunately. Uh, but he is coming around in other packs, and we are getting him slowly but surely in that. Uh, and here, Ben Solo, you can see we are getting some char extra shards for him. Uh, he's about halfway. Um, and we are getting pretty close to Cat, uh, Commander Ahsoka Tano, uh, BT1, and we're going to activate him, just kind of know where we're at with that uh, farm. And um, we'll add him in uh, as another hard node. Uh, I may focus this week a little bit on Chirotex, kind of build those up, and then we'll add him in. Um, not a whole lot of extra shards um, that he needs, but it is 60, so that possibility of six more farms on that Chirotex node. Uh, we do need to focus on Ray getting her ultimate finished off. Uh, I've been slacking on that for sure. Definitely could have had her uh, probably done by now, but I have been slacking. That event is just, it's not very much fun, and it takes a long time, and I've got to sit down and really concentrate on it. So, um, you know, I've watched several videos on it, and it's just not, it's not that entertaining to me. So we definitely have not uh, focused on it the way we probably should. Uh, Inquisitors, we'll go ahead and add this stuff to Seventh Sister. And then we'll focus our Chirotex on them this next week. Uh, try to get another one to gear 12. Uh, that's where I'd like to get most of them there. And then uh, we'll work on... This will be our next goal after that. So uh, after we get JML uh, started unlocking that, we'll be working on them to Relics. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this update. We did have quite a bit that we worked on this week. Uh, quite a bit of characters that were unlocking, getting seven stars and everything. And so hopefully you guys did enjoy the video. If you did, like, comment, subscribe. And as always, thanks for watching.